Hello Grade 11 learners! Welcome back to our video lesson. First of all, I would like to congratulate you for successfully finishing the first quarter of this school year 2021-2022. Keep up the good work and continue to learn more the second quarter. You are now watching the first episode of Quarter 2 video lesson. Are you ready for another topic about technology? I know you are. This is Sir Jason saying, just stay focused, just be happy, and just continue watching our video for today. Let's start. Before we begin with our lesson, I will be giving you a simple activity. This activity is called Media Jumbo. Here are the instructions. Guess the website or application that is being described. Arrange the jumbled words to get the correct answer. Did you get the instructions? That's good. Let's start. Number 1 Can you tell me what the word is? Good job! The correct answer is YouTube. What about this one? Can you tell me what this word is? The correct answer is SoundCloud. Next word. Can you tell me what the word is? That's great! The correct answer is TikTok. Next word. What about this one? Can you tell me what the word is? Amazing! The correct answer is Google Classroom. Next word. Can you tell me what the last word is? That's right. The correct answer is Instagram. Good job, everyone. Did you get all of them correctly? I know you did. What do you think is our topic for today? That's right! Our lesson for today is all about Multimedia and ICT. Before we proceed, I will present to you our objectives for this lesson. Your goal for today is to Number 1. Define what is multimedia And number 2. Identify the different multimedia contents before we move further, let us first define what is multimedia. Do you know what it is? Multimedia is an interactive means that the user or audience has control over the program or presentation. From the word multi, meaning many or different, and media, meaning system of communication. Multimedia is a way of interaction on communication between many people in many different ways. There are so many multimedia contents we see in the internet or in any media platforms. First, we have videos. How do we share this content? Through video hosting sites. You can take a video and show it to the world. Videos add more attraction to users and can be embedded within the content or stored outside the content. What is the most popular website you know to share your videos? You are correct. It is YouTube. The second multimedia content is sound, music, or 
Ojo. It can aid interaction with the user. It can also be added as a background. Can you name some website where we can share our music? That's right. We have Spotify, SoundCloud, Deezer, and many more. The third content is online game. It is an interactive online simulation of real life or fictional world events or situations. Users can also interact with each other online. Do you play games? I know most of you do. Some popular games are Mobile Legends, PUBG, Call of Duty, and many more. Aside from the popular contents, we also have the fourth one, which is online tests. In this content, online forms and tests automatically display the result when finished. For example, online IQ and personality tests. We also have number five, the courseware. This is the content that simulates the classroom online. It is designed for students and teachers. This includes online trainings and tutorials. An example of this is our IOS at Munoz episodes. The sixth type of content is podcast. What is podcast? It is an episodic series of audio or text files streamed online. An example of this is TED Talks. The last content is the vodcast. Just like podcast, it is also arranged in series or episodes. The only difference is that it uses video. Those are different contents in multimedia. Were you able to identify all of them? Very good! Now, to test your knowledge about multimedia, let me give you an activity. This activity is called Contentify. Here are the instructions. Are you ready? The first one. What type of content is shared on YouTube? That's correct. You can share videos or podcast. What about Spotify? What contents can be shared on Spotify? Very good. We can share music or audio and podcast. What about Mobile Legends? What type of content is Mobile Legends? You got it. It is an online game. Let's have the next one. What about Ayos at Munoz? That's right. It can fall under the course wheel. The last one. What type of content is an IQ test? Amazing. It is under the online test. Very good, everyone. Did you get all of them correctly? That's great. That is our topic for today. Did you learn something from this episode? I hope you did. See you again in our next video lesson. This is Sir Jazil saying, just stay focused, just be happy, and just wait for our next Ayos at Munoz e-tech episode. Bye!